All right, Coach, first scrimmage, just in your words, how did it go? Well, you know, it went good at times and not so good at times. We got a lot of operational things we got to, you know, we got to get done. It's hard for, you know, things like our quarterbacks to really throw the football effectively, that kind of stuff. But you, know, you have a protection, protection problem, it's not a problem. But, you know, besides that, you saw some guys out really working hard and practicing hard and that kind of stuff. We developing the kind of personnel that we need for, for next year. Yeah, about 17 incompletions. Uh, basically, I guess a lot of that was due to what uh, offensive line? Uh, due to the fact that you know we didn't protect all that well, and due to the fact that we didn't throw the ball that well from time to time. When you look at the, um, the guys, the way they played today, just who sort of stood out? Well, uh, I guess most of the guys that stood out on the defensive side. Those guys had most of the plays that we made today. Uh, but it's hard to decide sometimes, you know, if what they are doing is because of the fact that the defense is playing. Really well. Get into the midway point. Just would you have liked to have seen the team progress further than where they at right now? Well, it's, 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 it's pretty much this way in the spring. You know, it's not so unusual, and uh, you know, especially when you're breaking in some of the key positions that we're breaking in. When you, you know, when you're struggling down the middle a little bit, which is kind of what you know what those positions are—the quarterback, the you know, the center position. Sometimes you don't know which one is necessarily you know having a bit having the greatest difficulty. Tell them really quality backs. We got some quality guys there. I don't know how much more you know we'll be able to actually do with those guys. You know, we have a little bit of a struggle, you know, up front because you know you don't necessarily want to put those guys, you know, in a situation where you don't make them accessible to a whole lot of you know possible wear and tear that way. Well, where do things stand at center right now? Is it still Ishmael? Well, out? well, Devin Flowers was back today, and he got a chance to play most of the time. I think Ishmael is a guy that we still, you know, is a work in progress. You know, we got some guys that we that, that we like to think, you know, will eventually come on and be okay. Devin Flowers right now is the odds on the paper right now to be the guy because he's an experienced guy, you know, who's got a little more understanding. As the scrimmage got on, I think he may have gotten a little tired, didn't play quite as well. But, you know, there were times when he showed signs of being able to at least be, you know, adequate. You guys, with um, going into next scrimmage on Saturday, what do you need to pick up these next six days? Well, you, you want to try to do all those things that we did pull of the day better. You'd like to try to operate better offensively. The two things that I told them that we got to be better at, we got to move a little bit better. You know, we got we, we to have a little bit better understanding. You can tell because we tried to start so fast so fast that we're still swimming a little bit as far as understanding exactly where we're supposed to be in some of the lines of the and some of that kind of thing. So we can in a situation where we still got work to do as far as trying to, you know, polish ourselves and where our guys feel comfortable. Uh, as long as you're still having to think about where you go and what you do, I mean, it's hard to do. 